Okay, let's go. All right, uh, not bad. Uh, I think, what is this? I'm gonna use my template and put it all in this paragraph tag, setting a background of that. And we're gonna round the top. So that's a rounded top. It's got to be right at the top and actually we'll comment that out and make sure that we've got the margins correct. 14, 13, 12, that looks right. 2. And then we'll turn the border radius back on by commenting. Probably what we want is 200 is too much, 150, 60, 70, 80, 180. And that is it. And then we're looking at uh, my favorite, the conic gradient. Uh, or are we actually that background doesn't have to be a conic gradient it could be a 90 degree linear gradient so a linear gradient uh, that goes at an angle and starts with orange and then goes to blue, which will be transparent. And let's start it, because we got this thick part. We do this, and then transparent, and then this, and then that. I think that we get it. Uh, so let's start it at 100 pixels over and begin at 20 pixels down. Uh, for that, we'll leave it zero for now. We'll just do the striping first. 100 pixels wide, so we're getting the start of that. So it's, uh, we said it was gonna be thick orange, transparent, and then transparent. So thick orange, transparent, thin orange, and then transparent and that's it so let's say that's 200 wide and let's uh, do a no repeat so that we only get and then we'll put a pink in the background so that here's that's the actual the actual orange part is the only part that's the real gradient so the first thing we do is we need to place that where it starts and that means moving this over one forty five that's an even number all black is what's matching and then transparent would be rear pixels let's say So our width of our border that's our height okay so what have we got wrong oh because this pink is not accurate so the only way that we can really see that this is going to be correct uh, so let's let's make that pink the blue that reflects it a little bit better. Okay, so then okay, 
So is the start at 40? Yeah, it starts at 144. Goes over 72. One oh eight, and that looks right, huh? Uh, no, and then this goes another little bit, and actually, I need to be so then that's So what have we got wrong? So it's the orange at 72, and then transparent to 108, and then over to here at, oh, at a much different number, 130. There we go. 140, 31, 32, 33, 34. And then if we turn off the repeat, that should oh, almost get what we want. Not quite. Uh, okay. So what have we got wrong? Do we need to make that go a little bit further over? And don't be bothered about the uh, the top orange. That's that's going to be the easy part, I think. So this number is wrong. So it's 70, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 180. And then let's make sure that the repeat works. Painful, very painful, very, very painful. Okay, so it's just off a little. Uh, and I think that what that means is, I actually think that we've got the pattern correct, but this width needs to be different. So what have we got wrong? So that whole right hand side is correct, but then this is wrong. So let's say uh, 190, 90, 180. <laughs> There's a case where I guessed it, <laughs> uh, and that's correct. Um, does that mean that we don't need that? Yes. So we didn't need that final one. Now, to do the top part. So essentially, we're just going to do a repeat. X, and we need to start it lower. Uh, two. And what that also means is that we can't use transparent because we're going to use there we go awfully close but we're one pixel off uh, for this height so is it four no nope. five no six there it is I think we're going to submit and get 100%, and that's where I'll stop. You can do the notification, uh, but that's how I would do it. Still submitting, and let's stop. There it is, 100% match. Thanks for watching.